Davis now, the fourth quarter will begin in Davison's possession as they pass it around a little bit. Dearly has it now. Gives it off to Coleman on the wing. Fires it from way deep. He is. nails it! He was at least three or four feet away from the three-point line. And what a dagger from Cade Coleman there. Rubik with it now on the Pierce side. Give it to Knickerbocker. Back to Rubik. Way out to Hutton. Still has it. Off to Rubik. And it's almost swiped away there from Coleman, but it finds the hands of Jan Dan Mulhoney. Knickerbocker with it now. Fleming gets a nice steal there. They're looking to score on this turnover. And a beautiful move! Brendan Fleming with a nice move up and in. Once again, <laughs> the Allen Irishman's coming out of him here. Looks like McGee will score right back. Provide an answer for the McGeary. Lightning here. Fleming snuck around McGeary right there, and McGeary did it right back. Absolutely. <laughs> Wasn't happy about that one. 6.37 in this fourth quarter. 51 to 50 is your score. Davison only down by one. Hunter Clark will fire from the corner. And another three. Clark's taking the lead now 53 to 51. Things are heating up. <laughs> it is a long range battle here in the gym. I'm getting goosebumps. <laughs> wow, anyways, Rubik has the ball now. Out to McGeary on the wing. He still has it. Gives it up to Knickerbocker. Finding his way in. Nice toss back to Hutton there. He'll try and find his way in, but Goyette with the huge block. And he will keep the possession as well. After being taken down there by Aaron Hutton. And the momentum has shifted in Davison's favor without a doubt. Well, so far, the theme for the second half has been marksmanship. All right, both teams pulling out the long range guns, and wow, are they hit. It also speaks to their lack of uh, range defense. But absolutely pulling out <laughs> the big guns here. The guy's so far away, you can't even see him. What are you going to do? <laughs> exactly. So Davison will get, regain possession. <clears throat> or excuse me, retain possession after going off out of bounds off of a peer player. Fleming trying to find someone way deep. It's a race to it. it looks like Mike Barston will win it. But Kate Coleman will redeem himself with a huge block. And now Hunter Clark will have it back for the Cardinals. And Coleman and Marston are going at it, trying to get the ball. Marston came away with it. And a huge drop Brock and Coleman will get the ball right back. And it tipped and steal there against Fleming. He kept it. Coleman trying to get the layup there, but it is no good. And McGeary will take it back down for the pier. Very fast paced here. Hutton will fire from three. No good from the corner. There's Densmore coming in for Coleman. And Coleman Kate, have it. What an active what game a he's night, having yeah. tonight. Again, he's almost reminded me of Dylan Alderson with the way he has his effect on the game. He has the same number, same haircut, everything. Threes on threes and that defense. Absolutely. Wow. Fleming with it now. It is stolen by McGeary. And it's a fight for it between Densmore and Geary. Now Glenda Fleming will fight for it. And Chittle will have it for Davison. It's an all battle here for the ball. Looks like Dieterle will have it for Davison now. As he dribbles it in, puts it up. No good. Chittle will get the rebound, put it back in. And they get there it. it the crowd is on their feet here as they get loud. Timeout called by Coach Chuck Mahoney for the pier. Davidson still holds the lead, now leading by four, 55 to 51. What a turnaround, Grant. The tides have turned, absolutely.